welcome back to the vlog. It's been so long because I've just been so busy going through it with work. I am flying to Montreal to see my family. Haven't seen my brother since uh, our honeymoon, I think, or wedding. I don't know, I think so. We are at the Fairmont Queen Elizabeth. It's my first time in Montreal and I'm so excited here to hang out with my family. My brother lives in Ottawa and him and his girlfriend are driving here to Montreal and then my sister, what building is this? This is so cool. Oh my God, look at this view. And I'm in downtown Montreal, but yeah, so my sister and my niece flew from LA and they're heading to, uh, they did Toronto to Ottawa, Ottawa, my brother lives there, so he's picking them up. Checking out the gym. And there's the pool. I'm so excited. Ooh, there's a sauna. I'm gonna have to come here. I wanted to show you guys how I packed my yoga mat. So I have a lot of different kinds of yoga mats. So I have this one, which Everyday Yoga sent me a while back and it's the jade mat and it folds. Oh my gosh, it fits in my like carry-on. Like that, I have a yoga mat for class tomorrow and when I teach. Hello, freshly showered. I feel like a brand new person. I woke up at 5.30 and did not shower this morning. Um, I also wanted to share that I've been working with Osea. Sorry, I've been using it already so it's like greasy, but I absolutely love this body oil and they have a travel size and I'm so happy I could take it with me. I have a discount code, it's 10% off. It is Bianca B at checkout, but you can check out the link below. Gonna go out and get some vegan poutine. Um, come along. Montreal, baby. Walk into poutine. Montreal, I got my poutine, it's vegan and gluten free. Coconut ice cream. I'm back at the hotel now. Oh my gosh, that was so fun. So that's the really cool part about being a solo traveler is just like wandering off somewhere. And because I just randomly walked to this vegan gluten free place for dinner called Lola Rosa, it happened to be in the same area where the jazz festival was which meant I got to sit outside, listen to the jazz music, have some really good vegan gluten-free poutine which was made out with mushrooms. It was so good. I crushed the whole thing. And then a Caesar salad and a coconut vanilla ice cream dessert with fudge syrup on top, all vegan. And it was so well priced. I'm like unbelievable. Like Montreal is giving me good vibes so far. I am going to take a shower again. Today's Canada Day and there are probably like 5,000 people walking around. <laughs> I don't know. It was a lot of people. It's just really nice to get out of the bubble of Southern California and go somewhere new. Next isn't here because of scheduling conflicts at work with a lot of people taking time off. So it's just me and then my family comes tomorrow. Woohoo! Good morning, I am ready for yoga with my mat that I traveled with. I'm so proud of myself. Um, I found this new place called Enso Yoga. Well, new to me. Um, so yeah, let's check it out. Oh, this is the building that my, the hotel has a view of. It's a church. Wow. Such a pretty day today. My favorite thing on vacation is going to check out fitness studios. Is that surprising? <laughs> um, nothing like a good hot yoga class after traveling. I'm all puffy, look at my face. It's all good. That's just like traveling for you. This city is so clean and pretty. Little park on the walk. There it is. Wow, the studio is beautiful. Oh my gosh. 
such a beautiful space. That was the most lovely yoga class I've ever taken. It was hybrid French and English class. Oh my gosh, the French language is beautiful. Like the teacher, I just wanted her to talk in French the whole time, it was so beautiful. I'm back at the Fairmont. Um, that class was so lovely. The teacher was very inspiring. She had the most beautiful way of speaking French and English seamlessly. Like she would, it was like basically a bilingual class and she would then like switch from French to then English. It, it was so beautiful, oh my gosh. Um, but I still do need a shower and then I'm gonna do a quick pack, check out at noon, and then my family's gonna pick me up and then I finally go and get to see them. But gosh, I don't know, there's something so magical about hearing a yoga class in French. It was just very fun being in a new environment and I just can't wait to explore more of Montreal. I'm liking it so far. I'm here at their little coffee shop at the Fairmont and I'm gonna post up here and work for a little bit. The same set of cones in the same space. This is Ola, Hello. my brother's girlfriend. Welcome to the vlog. We're at Mont, Mont Royal, right? Mont Royal. Where literally like everyone favorite, has tattoos. Our tattoo shop is literally like across the street. Look at my brother's sleeve right here. Or no, that's the comma sleeve. The real sleeve is right there. <laughs> they have a really cool restroom. Yeah. Finally got my right smoothie here. that I wanted. The spot here is really, like a really cool. Lake Calgary gets freezing. Mm, it smells so good, it's strawberry season. Checking in to our Airbnb. We spent the whole afternoon walking around. Not bad. We are hot, hot, hot. Look at that, pure sweat. Mont Royal is a really cool place. I'm so glad I left downtown and checked out a new area. There's like a whole walkway where they, um, close it off to foot traffic and there's a bunch of restaurants and things to do. Um, so yeah, good afternoon so far. I asked Ola what she, what her request is from Trader Joe's and she said everything bagel. Oh, nice. And so I got her that, I know, right? And then they went to get bagels. It's really famous. How do you pronounce it? Saint Vietnam. Saint Vietnam. Look at that. Like, I mean, hold on, this deserves a zoom in moment. So when I asked if they had gluten free, they said no. So unfortunately, I can just smell it. It smells so good. Oh, I'm so jealous. It looks so good. You should eat some. I can't. I'll get so like swollen. What did you get? Blueberry? Blueberry. I'm just gonna live vicariously through this. Oh yeah. <laughs> So what do you think? What do you think of Monty? I love it so much. Let me see the arm. It's vibes, right? Yeah, it's so fun. I love it. Yeah, there's so much culture here. Like the French influence. Let's hear some French, Ola. Bonjour. Anything no. else? Comment ça va? Ça va bien. Let me get more chips. Keep going. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, no, it's so nice to get outside of my La Jolla, Newport Beach bubble. It's just like, there's a whole world outside of SoCal, you know? For sure. Especially Quebec. I know, it's so nice here. We're going to Old Port for dinner, but we're gonna take the, what do you call it, Metro? Metro boom and want some more. had dinner and then now we're strolling back apparently Cirque du Soleil was founded in Montreal I love it so much what check this photo out you see that red umbrella yeah. with the you see that red umbrella right there yeah that's where that that shot was with the oh. flowers his oh, album wow. art yeah, yeah. Right here, literally. but the flowers are outside the flowers are gone, yeah. oh. but also there's an F1 Formula 1 race track here oh. that we've actually uh, skateboarded through and then if you want croissant, you go to Boulangerie to get croissant. Croissant? 
<laughs> but so, if, you, if you want chocolate chip cookie, you go to uh, Patisakis. <laughs> well, there's a bit of Filipino <laughs> accent. So actually, I just learned tonight, I forgot that my brother used to live in Montreal. I, I was like, how do you know this place so well? And he's like, dude, I used to live here. It looks really good. It does, huh? Yeah, the bumblebee. I love. It's so cute. It's and so it all matches, actually. Like, the details of the skunk is so, like... It's just really well detailed. You, like, the subtle details in it, you know? Show YouTube your sleeve. Show YouTube my sleeve. That's so crazy. Accidentally gave away the fact that he had a sleeve. It was, like, my fault. My brother was, like, not gonna tell my parents until after he graduated Santa Barbara so that they wouldn't disown him. I mean, Filipino parents are, like, really traditional, and he kept it a secret from my dad, but my mom... I accidentally told my mom, and then basically... Basically, like, he ended up writing my dad a letter after graduation and was just like, hey, by the way, I have a tattoo. And my dad took it well. And so it was crazy, though. For two years, he wore, like, long sleeves. Um, even, like, at my birthday party at the beach, he wore, like, full pants and long sleeves hiding it. So, yeah, um, that's his tattoos. Good morning, vlog. It is Wednesday. I normally teach a yoga class on Wednesdays and today I'm going to record it for my students because normally it's live on Zoom but um, I just wanted to make sure I get it in quietly since we're staying in Airbnb so I have to do it in the morning today so um, yeah follow along. Back and exhale to your Humble warrior. I just finished teaching yoga and then me and my brother are gonna go on a bro and sis run. And that we'll go from there. Wait, this flower's so pretty. Had to send my students the recording for class and then back to running. My heart rate's 171 and his is what? 118? 111. 111. Uh, because he's been training for mar he did the marathon Toronto. He just did one other marathon just for fun. Just for fun. And then he did the half Ironman. So you're in cardio shape, bro. I'm in yoga, Pilates shape. I'm trying which, to I'm trying to get in that yoga shape though. Yeah, yeah, you should. You should I take sh my I've classes. Stretching, I've been stretching like 15 minutes a day. Yo, um, I have a YouTube channel. Did you know this? Oh, yeah, I'll check it out. <laughs> what? You're my brother. He Just say you already watch it. I'll watch it. <laughs> so cute. Yay, go Yogi. <laughs> Hit up this place for a green smoothie. I love being active on vacation. It's like my favorite thing. Oh, I'm gonna get this. Chia matcha cocoa. Wait, these look so good. Unbelievable. Wow. Oh my gosh, I needed this so bad. Mm. Green smoothie. Cafe Colum. All right, I showered. We are heading out for the day. More steps to come, y'all. I'm so excited. This is my sis, my bro, my niece, and my sister-in-law. Yeah, don't worry. I, I got it. We found a vegan gluten-free bakery. Another day, another metro. We got the three-day pass. We just got off the metro at the Victoria Square stop and we are heading to Crew Collective. Um, we're going to this cafe that is was a former bank, right? And now it's a co-working space and they serve coffee and drinks that we're going to go to we're in old uh old montreal we're going to eat at all he's it olive and gourmando olive at gourmando <laughs> wow i think that's an investment bank yeah. are there actual offices here they really did. It's like a bank. There's people working here, like working, working. 
I need a little immunity in my life right now. Be around so many people all day. Yeah. I love it. They actually dress up. Yeah. Oh. oh my god. <laughs> this is really spicy. Okay, so Tommy Cafe, another matcha spot. There's so many cool cafes here in Montreal. Wow. Tommy Cafe. Wow, oh, she's so cute. That's what being married is about. Came with the job. Okay, we are finally eating. We are at Olive et Gourmando. Scone witch. Butternut biscuit with butter, cheese, gold, cheddar. So you guys enjoy everything. Wait, that's so cute. No. You're on a different level. Oh! Olive et Gourmando did not disappoint. I told you, bro. One of the top like five you. lunches of my life. It was so good. So we're at Old Port now. We just finished our late lunch. I'm so grateful because my brother's just been planning like where to go and I just get to show up. Um, we're gonna do an escape room later. <laughs> so fun. Very European. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> it looks so fun. <laughs> Alright, we made it into the escape room, but it looks like it looks like scary, like I'm scared. Mm, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Take Oh, no, 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 we've done. No help. Someone in the vortex will help you, but not me. Wait, you mean there's someone in there? <gasps> I don't know. I don't know what. Wait, there. please. Is, this is not horror, right? <laughs> <laughs> I can't do scary. It's not a this is La cabane dans les bois. Your group is split up in two, oh. and the first half of the group is chained up against the wall we inside. Oh. The Wait, house. no, we that know. sounds horrible. And the unknown is also pretty cool. That's scary. You started the separate in two different rooms. Pitch black. Don't see your hand in front of your face. Oh. No, no, and I can't do that. Some is falling on your head. Oh, oh no. I can only body Dude, check. I thought I thought you hit yourself on the freaking oh. railing. Oh my gosh, daylight! I was, like, behind We're alive! <laughs> we escaped! No, we actually we did didn't solve escape. it. So we didn't solve the, the world. Ended. Yeah, but you know, we got to the last room, so. And we had a lot of fun and teamwork. We had teamwork. We literally Everyone... didn't even solve one thing. <laughs> yeah, we did! Everyone he gave could... us a hint for every single okay, one. Yeah. Okay, fine, <laughs> fine. It was really hard. <laughs> Ooh, they have vegan It Does it open late? Yeah, yeah, we're ready. So. Wow. <gasps> Thank you. Wow. Thank you so much. What's on that? Oh, sausage. Yeah. Oh, this line is crazy. La Banquise was delicious. It's kind of raining a little bit. And we have stumbled upon the Mont Royal Run Club. After La Banquise, I got myself a matcha from Tommy Cafe. And <laughs> this is so funny. Look. They're just sitting on the 